goal is to, to energize, uh, to bring electrification to Africa, all over rural Africa. And we started uh, two years ago, uh, and today we are in 11, uh, 14 countries now, uh, energizing, bringing energy to all over the continent, in the rural Africa, so with solar energy. But the process around that is not only bringing solar energy, street lights, and home systems, but it's also creating jobs around that. We've got millions of young Africans without work today. Right. What we're doing is to bring opportunities to train them, to give them the skills they need to, for them to install the lights, but go beyond just installing it as well also to maintain it. So it creates a job behind for those young people to bring sure. solutions for Africa. So what I was saying right now a minute ago at the UN here is that you know, this new generation of young Africans are not looking for aid anymore. We are here to create our own opportunities, you know, with the world to make sure that Africa is a playing field where it's a win-win situation for Africans and for anybody else who come in to invest. Because we truly believe that the aid is not helping us go anywhere. It's a, now the bottom line that people like us, young Africans, have traveled the world, have seen the world, have seen what it takes to develop a country or a continent, are coming back to make sure we bring the changes necessary. The child of Africa myself who was raised in Senegal in color. I kind of see what it felt like to live in poverty, understand what it meant to be in a position without light and go days without eating. So I kind of felt it, I understood it, but it made me cherish life even just that much more. Not only that, but it made me it put me in a position to be a lot more humble as a celebrity and understand and feel things that normal people feel.